Hi everyone and welcome to this snack size episode. In this episode I want to go through and show you how to do time dilation and what that means is basically how to slow down time uh, around the player as well as um, excluding the player. So it's very simple to do. All you do is go to your player character here for example and I'm going to do it on a key press. So I'm going to use the E key. So let me find the E key. Okay. So when I press it, I'm going to do, so if type in dilation, and you'll see set global time dilation. And what that means, it will affect the whole entire game by this amount. Now the amount you want to set it to is a variable, like a varying scale. So time dilation of one is its current like real time. Anything less than that is slower. Anything higher than that is faster. So when I push this, I want to make this equal to 0.25 so a quarter of the speed and when I let go of the key I'm going to go back to 1 hit compile push play so now um, I can shoot and if I push E while shooting you can see things slow down let go of E and then resume now, as I said, this is global, so this does affect the player. Notice I'm moving slow now. And if I wanted the player to move fast whilst the world is moving slow, we can do that too. So back on the player, we're going to right click and do set time dilation. And you'll see set custom time dilation. And we want two of these, one for each end of this uh, node here. And this is a multiplier, so it'll take where the global one is and multiply it by this to get the actor's time dilation. So if we're going at 0 0.25, to get that back to 1 full speed, I need to multiply it by 4. And on the set here, I'm going to change that down to 1, because 1 times 1 equals 1. So I'm remaining um, the real time speed. So if I push play... And you can see, I can still move around just the right sp same speed um, whilst everything else around me goes slow. Quite cool, eh? And you can do it with all sorts of things. You can do it in sort of bubbles as well, um, in triggers. You can do all sorts of things. Um, but yeah, have, experiment, with it. experiment with it. Have a bit of fun. And... Uh, let us know what you come up with. It'd be great to see what kind of uses you can find for this uh, little feature. Thank you for watching. If you want to watch more episodes like this, head over to patreon.com forward slash Ryan Ailey, where a donation of just $1 will get access to all my videos before anyone else months in advance. Thank you to all my patrons for their continued support. And this wouldn't be possible without you guys, so thank you again so, so much. Uh, if you haven't yet subscribed to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Leave a comment below if you have any questions, and I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.